which is 5 raised to the power x times 5 raised to the power x equals to 50 from here. And here, yeah, this follows what we have a times a, which can be written as a squared. That is, yeah, same thing multiplying. So we can write this as 5 raised to the power x all squared then equals to 50 from here then also here this follows when we have a raised to power m raised to power n which is same thing as a raised to power m n but this this power multiplies and we have 5 raised to power 2x equals to 50 from here the next step here, we take the log on both sides. That is, we have log 5 raised to the power 2x equals to log 50 from here. Then here we apply the power of log ring. And when we have log m raised to the power p, is the same thing as p log m. That is, the power here is 2x, and this becomes 2x log 5 equals to log 50 from here. The next step here, we divide both sides by log 5. Divide this side by log 5. Also, divide this side by log 5, which implies log 5 cancel each other here. We are left with 2x, which is equals to log 50 over log 5 here the next step here we can express 50 as 25 times 2 then what we have becomes 2x equals to log 25 times 2 over log 5 from here that is what we have here follows from the law of logarithm when we have log a times b which can be written as log a plus log b that is here what we have becomes 2x equals to log 25 plus log 2 over log 5 then here we separate this into two fractions and what we have becomes 2x equals to log 25 over log 5 then plus log 2 over log 5 that is next step here we can express 25 as 5 times 5 which is 5 squared and what we have becomes 2x equals to log 5 square over log 5 plus log 2 over log 5. Then when we apply the power of log here, yeah, 2 comes here and we have 2x equals to 2 log 5 over log 5 plus log 2 over log 5 that is from here log 5 comes each other we have 2 left that is 2x equals to 2 plus log 2 over log 5 the next step here we apply change of base from here when we have log a over log b this is the same thing as log a to base b and this is what we have here becomes 2x equals to 2 plus log 2 to base 5 then here we divide both sides by 2 that is divide this side by 2 also divide this side by 2 2 cancel each other here and we have x equals to 2 plus log 2 base 5 
over 2. So here we have the value of x in this problem as 2 plus log 2 base 5 over 2. Now let's check if this satisfies this given problem. That is, we have x equals to 2 plus log 2 base 5 over 2. And when we substitute here, this becomes 5 raised to power 2 plus log 2 base 5 over 2, then times also 5 raised to power 2 plus log 2 base 5 over 2 is equal to 50 on this side. Then here, this multiplier we have same base here we can add the power so we have a raised to power him then it's a raised to power him the power also the same and this becomes a raised to power m plus m which is 2m as this here we can write this as 5 raised to power 2 times 2 plus log 2 base 5 over 2 is equal to 50 on this side that is from here, this power multiplies and 2 here cancel each other. Then we have 5 raised to power 2 plus log 2 base 5 left is equal to 50 from here. Then also from the law of indices, a raised to power m plus n is the same thing as a raised to power m times a raised to power n. That is here we have 5 square times 5 raised to power log 2 base 5 is it equals to 50 from here then 5 square here 5 times 5 that's 25 then times here follows when we have a raised to power log b to base a which is equals to b as this here what we have same thing as 2 is equals to 50 from here then 25 times 2 here give us 50, which is equal to 50 on this side. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. Hence from here, we conclude that x equals to 2 plus log 2 base 5 all over 2 satisfies this given problem. And thank you for watching us here at Master Team of Class. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn the notification bell on. Share this video, give it a thumbs up. See you next class and bye for now.